Hey, it's Chris from Scarlet Machinery. We're here today to talk a little bit about the brand new Ritter R2063 six degree low angle pocket cutting machine. This is a brand new design from Ritter and we're here to talk, tell you a little bit about it, show you the inside and outside of it and how it works and explain a little bit about the operation. So pocket cutting is useful in, in face frame construction, uh, furniture, all kinds of different applications where a pocket cut is a really great useful tool, right? So having a machine, an industrial machine, like this Ritter machine, to help make these pocket cuts uh, clean and efficient with a pilot hole is really important. So we're gonna tell you a little bit about the machine and how it operates here. I'm gonna give you a quick demonstration of the operation and then we'll dig into the machine. Here we go, we'll fire it up. We'll put our part in, All right, we'll slide it in, hit the foot pedal. And boom, just like that, we've got a beautiful pocket, pocket hole with a nice pilot hole right here. It's great. Nice clean cut, it's wonderful. Why don't you come on over here a little closer and we'll kind of show you the, the guts underneath the hood, so to say, of this brand new Ritter R2063. It's got a nice latch underneath here, right? We pick it up, boom, then we can have a little look inside. All right, this is really cool. It has a two horsepower router spindle motor here with a 3 8 inch router bit. Now that's gonna be cutting the slot right here every time. This one right here, this router motor up top is a nine, nine tenths horsepower, almost a horsepower to do this little, uh, little, little pilot hole right here, right? I'm gonna unhook the air a second so you can kind of see what happens. See how that machine, it just pivots back and forth. It's pretty straightforward. It's just a, a foot pedal, and then this whole uh, assembly pivots back and forth to make the, uh, the pocket hole and then the pilot hole, just like that, right? So underneath, it's pretty straightforward and simple. Two horsepower motor with a 3 8 inch bit here, 9 tenths of a horsepower router spindle up here. Pretty easy. It's nice, it's got the safety interlocks, pneumatic cylinders, valves, I mean, it's pretty simple and straightforward. All right, come around this side here and let's have a little look inside the electrical panel. This, the 2063 model is wired standard, 240, three phase power. If we look inside, uh, we've got here uh, Schneider Electric uh, PLC um, and a 24 volt control. It's all, it's all great stuff. We'll hook the air back up. Here, compressed air hooks up here. Uh, if you come around the back, I don't know if you can see this, but it has a, a four inch diameter dust port on the back. So that's where you hook up your dust collection on the back, four inch dust port on the back. All right, come around the front here. This machine's also offered in the 2061 version, which is a single, single phase. Uh, version of this, not the three-phase. Little, little lower, if you, if you don't have three-phase power, you could opt for the 2061, and that would be the single-phase option. Uh, but we have three-phase power, more of an industrial machine, so we go with the three-phase. All right, here we go. So you have the safety interlock. We're gonna drop the hood down. Now here's what's cool here too about this. Uh, there's a pneumatic hold down on the top to hold the workpiece, but you can also set these offsets right here, see these little guide fences? They slide back and forth. So say for instance, if you wanted to do uh, two slots, we'll do that next. We'll get a, a piece of wood and we'll do, uh, rather than one, we'll do two slots here, right? So you can do, you can offset these, these, uh, these, these blocks so that you can do two slots, one against each side. So here's what we'll do. We'll go in. The first one, right, and then we'll slide it over and hit it again. Boom. Then we've got two. See, then we've got two pocket holes, right? And you can adjust each of these side part side pieces to to accommodate for how wide or how far you want it from the edge. Pretty cool, right? We'll do another one here. It's super simple. Slide it in. Hit the foot pedal. 
Boom. And there it is. Super easy. So again, this is the Ritter R2063, six degree, low angle pocket cutting machine. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to any of us here at Scarlet Machinery. We're happy to help you. Thanks for watching.